All right, guys, welcome to this week's video. Today is a little bit different. We're actually going to be installing a backup camera and we're gonna show you what brand we got. We're gonna tell you the reviews of it. And right now we're gonna show you how to install it. And this is what it looks like. So we got the model that you can replace the one of your indicator lights on the top and then it has the backup camera integrated into it and it should be a seamless simple install we're just going to take that center light down we're going to install this guy up there a couple tools you'll need screwdriver some wire strippers are going to be helpful you can use electrical tape but what i found to be extra easy is these little dolphin um, wire nuts they're not really nuts but you just crimp them once you put the wires together then you use your wire strippers and you crimp them on crimp the wires together and you're done so let's get started and let's hop over to the install all right guys so we're up here by the lights and i've already gone ahead and taken off the light cover to the center light and what we need to do is just take out these two screws that are up here so let's go ahead and do that So once you got those two screws removed, now we can go ahead and pull the light fixture away from the RV, exposing the cables behind there. It is important to note that if you do not have a existing red and black wire, that you use a voltmeter to find out what is your positive cable and what is your negative cable, so that way your camera will indeed light up when you turn the lights on. When I tried to use the old screws that came off of the old light fixture, I quickly realized that those would not be sufficient enough to hold the new camera up there as this is a little bit heavier. So I had to go with a bigger screw head so that way it would be able to grab the wood that is behind there and make it more secure. All right guys, so we're here in the truck and we're going to mount our backup camera monitor and what this one came with is a rear view mirror mount and you can see kind of just elastic bungee over it so real simple easy pop it on when you're using the trailer and you can take it off when you're done we're gonna put that on right now and Get it plugged into our power and then we'll be good like i said we got the mount up it's attached just right to the rear view mirror we got it on at least we got power to it so we just got to go through the menu and configure it and get it to pick up our rear view camera and if you see the flickering it's just because that's what comes through on cameras when you videotape a LCD screen you'll see that flickering the way this camera works is it only get the camera only gets power when you are hooked up to your truck and it supplies power to the light then it will supply power to the camera and that's when the camera will turn on all right so as you can see now we have image on our screen as soon as I got power to the camera it came right up. I didn't have to do any options, any menus or anything. There are a ton of menus or uh, options in and on this monitor here. You can tell the signal strength, how good that signal from the wireless. Uh, the reason why you see the number one is because you can actually have up to four cameras integrated into this system. And then what I did to adjust my lines is I adjusted the camera so that way it shows my red line that's my stopping point so I put it just outside where my tire is my spare tire and I put it just up 
as you can see just a little bit so that way I know that is pretty much the stopping point um, green you still got a little bit of room obviously it's just like a backup camera so you can see how close you are to whatever's behind you and as you saw Jennifer waving that is um, she was pretty close to the back of the rig but there was still plenty of distance so what I think of this system with the setup thumbs up so if you like to purchase this if you like the big screen let us know in the comments below and also we will have the description the product description below and we'll have a link to the Amazon affiliate store where you can buy it that is it simple easy setup thank you to FXT technology for reaching out and giving us a chance to do this product review of their backup camera. We hope that you liked what you saw. And if you guys are looking for a backup camera for your rig, we hope that you consider checking out their website, which we will link in the description below. We really hope that you enjoyed watching how we hooked it up and set it up. And it was a very easy process. So we thank you for tuning in and watching. And I think that's it, yep. right? That's okay. it. If you like this video, Go check out some of our other videos as well. Give us a great big like on this video. Consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. And with that, we will see you later. Peace. Peace.